congratulations on your 2007 Honda Odyssey. Today I'll be going over it and uh, demonstrating how to use your ramp. So first thing to operate the ramp is you can actually use your key fob here and you will keep your hand on this button here. That is going to open the door and then deploy out your ramp. So as we make our way inside, um, you will notice there are four manual straps uh, for your wheelchair. And the way these work is you will actually have a tab here, which you can lift up like so. And then you can pull to adjust. And then once you find uh, the point on the wheelchair, you can ratchet it like this. Lock it in its spot. And you can put these in any position you would like. Uh, to remove them, you will just pull on this black tab here. Um, to put them back down, you just need to align it with the track. And put it straight down like this. And now you are locked in. And then for your seat belt, you will use this buckle on the floor here. And you can use this original uh, seat belt from Honda. And the way this works is you will, you will buckle it in like so. And of course this can come out uh, like this. There are a few buttons on the inside of the van uh, which is going to operate the ramp as well. One of them being here, so you'll have to push up like so. And this is going to close the door. You have also another button here, which is the original Honda button. That is also going to operate your uh, ramp and door. There's also an on and off switch here. This is going to turn off or turn on your kneeling feature, uh, which lowers the vehicle. So in case you are parallel parking, uh, you want to have that in the off position so the car uh, doesn't lower and the ramp can go right over the curb. If you would like to ride in the front position, you are able to do so. This chair is removable. And the way you remove it is you will have this harness here on the side, which you can twist. And pull out like so. And then you will have a lever here, which you can push down on and the chair will be sitting on tires. Um, last but not least, in case of an emergency, um, down right under the third row seat, uh, you do have a button which is located here. This is going to be the button to raise up your kneeling in case you are stuck in the kneeling position. So you'll uh, flip that switch up and the kneeling uh, should come up. And then lastly, uh, right down here, this is going to be uh, the spot where you can put in the manual crank and the manual crank will be located on the back uh, driver's seat. So the way you want to do this is you put it in this hole here, take out the metal part, and then you will see a hole which you can uh, put it in like so, and then you can start twisting. And as you can see, as I'm twisting, the ramp is uh, coming in. So if you have any additional questions, uh, please feel free to reach out to us uh, at 949-664-1146. Thank you.